And you boys in France? You know a man of cigarettes? Smoke. Let us play some Peaky Blinders trivia today, shall we? Now, how many cigarettes did Thomas Shelby smoke throughout the show? Especially in the first two seasons. And is it safe for a person to smoke that much? Subscribe to our channel for more on Peaky Blinders. Although the show might be over, many updates are coming that you do not want to miss. Peaky Blinders, created by Stephen Knight, is one of the most admired shows in British TV history. Is there any man here named Shelby? I'm looking for Thomas Shelby. The six serial show first aired in 2013, and fans are still awaiting more despite its final season. If you saw the first two seasons at least, you would know that Thomas Shelby did not appear in a scene without cigarettes. By the way, Christ. He went against the mafia, doggy police officers, and fascist politicians while smoking every turn of the way. To be fair, he won the National Television Awards 2020 Best Drama Performance in Irish Film and Television Awards. And the National Television Award goes to... Killian Murphy, Peaky Blinders. Best actor in a lead role in a drama for smoking that much so we can say it was worth it. Murphy noted that he smoked 3,000 cigarettes throughout the filming of season two. That was just 12 episodes. What the hell? I asked the prop guys to count how many I smoked just out of interest, and they think it's something like 3,000. That's, that's, that's impossible. Moreover, Murphy developed his peculiar smoking skills as the shows progressed. He told U.S. Sun that his style of rubbing the cigarette filter around his lips before smoking is to dampen the end of the cigarettes. He also revealed that the prop department always cut the filter out. These adjustments developed over time as he got used to the character. If he smoked 3,000 by two episodes, what would be the estimate for five seasons? And then for the final season we just saw? Reddit has the answers, and we will share them with you once we tell you what Murphy thinks about the cigarette lifestyle. When Murphy spoke to The Independent, he expressed that his chain-smoking character was representative of the young people of the period the show is set in. Murphy claimed that at that age, people smoked a lot. To illustrate the era was after the First World War, Murphy said people did smoke all day back then, and it just became a Tommy thing. Notwithstanding, production ensured that all the cigarettes Murphy used were herbal. Those are not addicted because they are tobacco and nicotine-free. In fact, Knight joked about the herbal cigarettes on set all the time, Murphy revealed. According to him, there were these rose cigarettes that are herbal. Steve would joke they're one of your five in a day. Of course, he had to give us a number for the entire period. Indeed, Reddit had its say with the estimates. What we see on screen is not exactly the same as what goes into the filming. There are cuts and retakes where more cigarettes will be used to perfect a single scene. One fan noted that his younger brother challenged him to count how many cigarettes Tommy smoked in each scene of each season. At the end of the five seasons, he counted 216 times. Here is the breakdown according to this overzealous fan. Season 144, Season 256, Season 342, Season 448, Season 526. Another fan shared that if they used 3,000 cigarettes for two seasons, for real? They would need 9,000 to complete all six seasons. Ah, oh, come on! We know the logic is flawed because smoking decreased as the show progressed. Still, please share your thoughts with us in the comments about how many cigarettes you believe Tommy Shelby smoked. Since you enjoyed this video, we should go ahead and, and suggest a video on the upcoming grand finale of Peaky Blinders. Stephen Knight, has said that we will receive a film to bid the show farewell. Well, we're going to make a film, um, a feature film, which will uh, move the world on. And you can catch all the details in our video titled Peaky Blinders is getting a final film. Watch it now.